Well, this very much depends on the clinic. And this is something that you always have to uh, ask your um, specialist, your doctor, when you talk about it. Um, and just to give you an idea of how it works here at uh, EBRMA. So we know that for young patients below 35, uh, if we have a good number of eggs stored, uh, like between uh, 10 and 15, as we mentioned before, then we will get a uh, um, um, chance of between 50, 60 percent uh, chance of a live birth, um, um, uh, thawing them and, and fertilizing them. And that's for us is a very good chance. Um, of course, if we, as we mentioned before, we, we always have to take into account what we, call, what we call the cumulative pregnancy rate. That means not only using the first embryo that we get from the eggs, but also, also using the rest of the embryos that can um, have been frozen as a result of the first egg thawing. So if we take into account uh, cumulative pregnancy rates, we can go up to um, even 80, 90% uh, cumulative um, live birth rate when we have um, 20, 25 eggs frozen from a young woman. And this um, usually is between above 35 or especially 38. We know that the chances of, of having a pregnancy will be reduced. But still, if we have a good number of eggs, we will, can get something um, in the region of between uh, 30, uh, 50 percent uh, if we have um, 15 eggs or so um, um, frozen from them. But this very much depends on the clinic. So I'm going to give you a rough estimation. And this is something that you have to discuss and, and ask your uh, specialist to uh, show you uh, the success rates.